so yeah it's, um after harvesting my aloe vera plants and they are washed thoroughly washed and they're beautiful so the aim here was to use part of them for aloe vera hydrosol and the other parts for aloe vera juice so i'm not going to in this video i'm not going to be showing you how i made aloe vera hydrosol if you want to know how i made that you can drop a comment on on there in the comment section and if i see much comment about this i might consider making this and filming it so that you can see however I'll, in this video i'll be showing you how i made my aloe vera juice for cosmetic formulation so i'm simply peeling off the skin and trying to remove off the gel from this part because i want to use the gel but if it was um and for the hydrosol for hydrosols i'll be using both the skin and the gel so i would not want to peel the skin okay so it's just to cut the skin and the gel and just cut the stems in little pieces take them into a bowl use um, a stick blender to blend them thoroughly until they are totally watery and liquid because when i make my hydrosols i don't like adding an extra water so i just go ahead to distill them like this so that they can be super concentrated so that's that for hydrosols like this but then let's get back to making our um gel our juice aloe vera juice okay so i'm extracting the gel into a plate because for this recipe we'll be needing just the gel after taking out all the gel from the stems of the aloe vera i'm just gonna go ahead and blend them with my stick blender until they are totally watery make sure that your stick blender is sanitized your working space is sanitized and your bowl your uh, mixing bowl sanitized as well so that you don't contaminate your aloe vera juice it's very important so after blending this until it's totally liquid i'm just gonna go ahead to strain this and get out the gel so guys let me use this medium to welcome you all both old and new subbies welcome to my channel if this is the first video you're watching here on prime side you're welcome here we share recipes on hair care and skincare that are natural and super effective please i beg for your support do not forget to subscribe to this channel it's totally free and please also help me like this video once straining is done make sure you get the amount of gel that you got and then add the same amount of distilled water to the aloe vera gel for example if you had 100 grams of aloe vera gel you're gonna add um, 100 grams of distilled water furthermore you can go in with one percent of your jamal plus preservative to prevent the solution from going molds if you're not using it up immediately so what i have here is 100 grams of aloe vera gel 100 grams of distilled water and two grams of of jamal plus preservative i'm going to give a very good stir and we simply transfer this into an airtight bottle to keep the mixture safe aloe vera juice can be used largely in cosmetic formulation um to replace distilled water or to add up to distilled water or other kind of hydrosols depending on the formulation you want to use so after stirring for like three days the color changed to something like this on my research i found that it's normal and it was going to change back to a plain color like this again so this was what we got after about seven days and after another filter because the color settled down and i had to filter to get this color all right so this is ready for formulation i'm going to be making an aloe vera bar soup with this juice so please stay tuned on my channel and you get that video all right so thank you so much for watching and see you next time